non-indigenous worker in the United States. And this is a Eukarya Ude. Chiwendu Amanambo. Also disengaged. Agnes Woko. Agnes Woko. Disengaged. Ikechu Kobunu. From Ima. All from from Ima State. Okay. Can you tell us why? Yeah. Yeah. Well. We are here um, in the first place to say a very big thank you to Governor Teodoji for his uh, this magnanimity uh, by by calling us back to start work in Abia State Workforce. You see, uh, earlier on, when this decision was taken in this state, uh, I don't think. Uh, it was the first in Nigeria. Uh, before this time, we've been working here, and we had uh, so many states, so many states disengaged their own workers. And uh, and uh, by the grace of God, the government of uh, Chief T. Uh, uh, absorbed uh, his uh, that, uh, their own people. Then when this uh, when this when this uh, this disengaged uh, that, that when this when this process was going on when they when when uh, they, they were compiling the list I am Charles Osweka, I work with local government service commission in Abia State here yeah. my name wasn't included uh, because one I was born here in Omaha and I I grew up here I was brought up here uh, 52 school road that was where. I was born. So um, I was not included. But because of the fact that uh, the governor there in my state, Imo State, was uh, going on air, telling all of us to start coming back to Imo, that he's going to uh, that employ us immediately. That was why I fought to include my name, thinking that the man is real thinking that the man is real, but it's unfortunate. After I made myself included, up to this moment, nothing has happened. We have tried as much as possible to reach him, all to no avail, to the extent that when this thing happened, uh, we grouped ourselves in our thousands. We went to Imo State Government House, with the little money we don't have. We managed to charter buses and all that. We went to Imo State. But it's very, very unfortunate that we were at the gate of government house in Imo State. Up till, for so many hours in fact. But the man, we met him, but he, he, never, he never behaved as if he saw people. He drew, we were there when he drove out, when he drove out, but we still waited till he came back and drove direct to his, his uh, this government house, but no audience was given to us. We had some people who were going to Imo State to solicit for us, but upon all they did, nothing happened. So uh, we don't have any option. Then uh, Otendo disengaged us really with the hope that our governors, we are going to engage us. Mm -hmm. But when he has seen us suffering. suffering in the street, because of his goodwill, because of the kind of person he is, because of his kind-hearted uh, 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 disposition, he had to call us back. So that is why we are here. We are here to say a very big thank you to him. And I want to say here that I've heard that most people go on Facebook to 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 uh, 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 they, uh, I had I had that so many people go on Facebook to uh, uh, to to they, that discredit this uh, this uh, the, the, the decision uh, in these guys that they are amongst us and in these guys that they are non indigenous uh, uh, disengaged non indigenous I bet you here and then that those people are fake. fake. Non 
no, no, nobody who has suffered with us for two years out of service. And this time, it's called back. We go, we go to say that what Ochendo did is wrong. <coughs> so I believe, believe you, me, that any person who has, who has, who is going to, uh, who is, who is going on there, who is going on Facebook and all that, to discredit the decision of Governor Theo Dodge, uh, that I don't think that person mean well to us. So I pray and I thank him for what he has done, and uh, we commit his life over to Almighty God to continue to keep him safe and alive for us. For I know better things will still come our way. Thank you. Okay.